so a few days ago we went out <clears throat> it was super calm conditions the fish were cruising the bank I could see them cruising I was having a hard time uh, catching them when I got close to them oh most country back here Super shallow, kind of like muddy back bay, but it warms up really quick. So like the one foot of shallow water was like two or three degrees warmer than you know the main bay. So, so anyway, I was having trouble catching these fish when I got close to them, so I upgraded to the 8 inch death adder. And I chose the clear red because there's a lot of pollen in the water and man it just kind of has like that Okeechobee Florida tint to it, kind of a little iron ore tint and this kind of just glowed back there so I could back way off the fish and really bomb this eight, eight inch death adder up there. <clears throat> and I got it rigged on an owner beast hook with a twist lock. And the deal is, instead of rigging it like on the skinny side up, it's rigging it flat side and just working it like a fluke and like a Cinco and it just kind of like fluttered down. Yeah, they were crushing the big Twizzler and I was just rigging it Texas style on it so it was weedless. And man, it worked awesome. Depth's death adder, 8 inch, clear red, dirt shallow. So we're sitting dirt shallow. I mean, trolling motor's kicking up mud. We're under two feet, we're about a foot and a half. Fish are cruising the bank. May 23rd, 60 degree water temp. There's been some toads sitting up shallow. Oh, jeez. I tried to get them on a chatterbait and a, a, a Kitek with a underspin rigged on it, weedless and they were just slapping at it. They're running with it like crazy. I'm just having to reel as fast as I can to catch up with them and then hopefully get a hook into them. Again, when the bite's tough, we're gonna upgrade, upsize into the eight inch death adder.
actually not that big. 